हेलो फ्रेंड्स हाय डॉक्टर मोहनल वर्मा फ्रॉम कंपटिशनल डायनोमिक रिसर्च लैब डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ अप्लाइड फिजिक्स श्री शंकराचार्य टेक्निकल कैंपस जुनवानी भिलाई वेलकम यू ऑल इन द लेक्चर नंबर ट्वेल्व द टाइटल ऑफ दिस लेक्चर इज के पार्ट फाइंडिंग एन एनर्जी बैंड प्लाट्स इन सिस्टर दिस इज द पार्ट ऑफ माई वीडियो सीरीज द मॉलिकुलर मॉडलिंग थ्रू सिस्टर विच इज एक्चुअली हैंड्स ऑन फॉर हैंड्स ऑन टूटर फॉर बिगनर्स द सिंगल ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ दिस लेक्चर इज टू कंप्यूट एंड एनालाइज the band structure so for introductory information of energy band analysis i will recommend first go through the sister tutorials for band analysis as i have mentioned earlier sister web page is well documented and there are two links for band analysis is given one you can search you can google it that uh, Uh, the mgo band analysis in pdf format and uh, you can get through it and i will also recommend to study to know the students some uh, fundamental parameters related to band structures one is the reciprocal space second e versus k brillian jones and other uh, and the origin of bands wigner c cells and uh, introduction to brillian jones and these are some youtube links to Uh, no these parameters in detail as far as the methodology is concerned we have a good fdf file uh, to run system to run band analysis we have to add such additional block in that fdf file as an example for abscess lattice this is the block and uh, one student and his research scholars are facing to get this uh, uh, block uh, uh, actually that k pan k path and uh, in this uh, case this last column is uh, optional latex latex label and uh, when by adding this when we run this uh, fdf file we get uh, one bands file and uh, by using some one post processing tools that is known as genio bands we can get uh, data file uh, to plot now for uh, this uh, k k path which is very difficult to uh, get as a student uh, and uh, research are facing some problem to get this k path and uh, we can use uh, some tools some methods one is uh, that k vector type and brillian jones and this is the link and second we can use this sick path to get this k path finder and visualize this is the uh, the link for materials cloud from the uh, materials cloud dot org and uh, now i um, i would like to say that we should go to that demonstration part to see the details how we can get this k um, path find how can we use this k path finder and get that k path to get uh, required that uh, Um, required uh, symmetry points and run system so now this is my <coughs> folder where i am using this uh, mgo that is space group is 221 and uh, uh, this is the folder optimized folder and the system is optimized here so first of all i would like to show you the fdf file created this is uh, the fdf file and the system name and other things are same k point is here k vector is here and i have taken this uh, fractional uh, coordinate system dgp is here and uh, one point which i would like to mention here is that is the additional point this is uh, the block band lines uh, to get that uh, uh, bands file uh, after system now how we can get these lines this is important so method number first is to use uh, one uh, tool which is uh, uh, used in x christian and uh, that is the conversion of xv file in uh, x christian format so here uh, where that uh, xv file this is that x xv file in this optimized system and uh, we will convert this into x sf by using uh, xv to 
x is f utility which is uh, given in uh, utils and uh, this is uh, now so now we have to give uh, a specific system name and that is that m0221 so let's uh, copy and uh, paste here i think uh, it should run so found and open this file and i uh, yes uh, it's actually i have already run that so uh, there is one file so i would have to um, overwrite it so now i have this uh, xv file and uh, uh, which i have to open by using x christian so x christian um, this is that my x christian file and uh, i can open the structure here this is in xf format and with that uh, this is uh, mg file and uh, one uh, this is the file so this is that uh, uh, quite file in that this is the mgo and now i will use this tool for kpart finder and uh, some more information um, for a new supporting brush let us several this kpart Th that is this is the link which i have mentioned in um, that uh, ppt so now this is that the center point and uh, uh, we can get different uh, points by clicking different we can get that k path by clicking different points so this is the center when i click here uh, this is the first point that is 0 0 and then first and nearest uh, point will be somewhere here so i can get this is the second point okay so this is the second point x and uh, similarly some other points we can get this is the third point and uh, uh, this is the third one so similarly we can get different uh, uh, symmetry points by using uh, this uh, tool and uh, there is some is other tools also to get uh, these points are as I have mentioned is seek k path this is another uh, tool seek k path to get this k path is now I have to choose one file that is in CIA format and uh, uh, where that uh, MGO this is MGO tutorials and I have this CIF file and this is that uh, uh, file format of this and now uh, this is the term and I will open calculate my structure so this is the system This is the system and under uh, uh, study different points symmetry points are inserted here. This is zeta, r, m, x, and and uh, this uh, path is with that symmetry path. This is the symmetry path, and these are the points. So this symmetry path we just follow this path, and uh, these are the points and uh, mentioned in. Uh, that MDF file and another tool is this uh, K vector where if you know this uh, um, space group you can get that uh, symmetry points also so that uh, the space group of this MGO is 2 to 1 I have uh, already mentioned in this uh, input file type so let's use this 2 to 1 here 2 to 1 and uh, to type and let us get these are the points these are the coordinates these are the coordinates and these are the points and we can get path by using this uh, brilliant zones and so this is a different symmetry points and we can start from here to here here and uh, the points are there and also we can paste that values 
an FDF file and run uh, sister. So sister run is simple. We will use that uh, command to sister run where this FDF file is here. This is the FDF file. This will take some time to run. Mm. So I'm running this in the optimized folder. And, uh, now, when computation has been started, and uh, one bands file is this is that bands file. This one is and. Uh, by using that so now I have to copy this in uh, this band file in another folder that is this bands and uh, so now let's convert this same um, bands into uh, dead file by using GNU bands so GNU bands this utility is uh, given in uh, utils directory of system and this is geno bands and uh, uh, now bands file and this bands and uh, bands dot right. so now this geno bands actually create um, that bands uh, converts these bands into uh, a data file uh, using two columns. Now one can uh, plot this uh, data file by using xmgrace. So this is that uh, xmgrace plot, and uh, now we can decorate this. So first of all, uh, I would like to shift this Fermi energy level into. Uh, zero point so where is the data so let's uh, transform uh, this uh, data by using the expression so this is the terms and i have to shift this y axis is equal to y plus the fermi energy values so fermi energy level is uh, mentioned here in this bands file at the top of this this is that fermi energy level so 6.5046 or 47 so 6.5047 so this is 6.5047 and let's apply this now let us change the range from minus 5 to plus 5 with a gap of 2 so this is uh, the file and I would also change x axis with the desirable value and that is uh, x axis is from 0 to uh, how much the maximum value is it is mentioned as 4.7 to 3 so this is uh, 4.723 so now this is point center uh, one can change the color of this by using so all these are just uh, uh, for the decoration so these are uh, decorating terms so for energy level has been shifted here and one can get that uh, band gap by using these two uh, same key points uh, terms that is a jitter point and uh, we can draw up different lines um, by using this uh, tool and uh, but before that uh, I also 
change Let's have some. Let's draw some lines here, and uh, drawing objects are here. And this is uh, the line property. And now 1.5 black and uh, uh, change the properties. Accept close. So first line will be here, and second line, uh, the points are here. Second is 624663. So we will draw a line. It uh, uh, with that uh, point. Six, six, somewhere like that. So just uh, give a proper place. So this is as worldwide, and uh, change the data it uh, exactly what you are given here. That is six two four six six. This is six two four six six here also, and also in the second part. That is point six two. Six four eight uh, apply. What happened? There is something wrong. I think there is something wrong. Zero point six two four six six. Okay, so this is the first line, and uh, similarly, second line can be drawn, and uh, we can add text here, and uh, that point is uh, denoted as in this one file that is x. So this is x. We can change so this is the term so we can decorate and denote different points x axis y axis everything and uh, we will have a very beautiful plot if we print this uh, in EPS format and the uh, resolution can be changed here and uh, one can get this uh, apply and uh, just to get print okay so uh, let me show what uh, I have done earlier in final form uh, as a band plot this is a very good band plot I have decorated myself so best of luck you will have such beautiful band plots of your system too and uh, so so as an outcome of uh, this lectures after the successful completion of this i think one will able to get keep out for the further use in the system file for band analysis one can have interactive band plot using xm grace and the direct and indirect band gap of this system under study can be obtained by a student. This direct band gap is actually uh, the band gap between same K points and the indirect band gap is uh, band gap between uh, different K points. And for band, fat band analysis, you can go through the link. This is uh, the fat, fat band analysis and uh, the tutorials are the same given in the sister web page. So this is my research group. And uh, Dr. B. K. Shoro, and, um, other research scholars working uh, actively under my guidance. And uh, as an acknowledgement, I gratefully acknowledge the kind support of my guide, Dr. Rakesh Chandra Krawal, and the helpful discussion with Dr. Uh, Professor Vinder Pandey and uh, uh, Rodrigo Archen Don't forget to give your valuable feedback. Thank you.